We are directly into the third game. We missed absolutely nothing. This is fantastic. We have now the same civilization, right? But switching. So what are they going to do, guys? What are they going to do, guys? This is absolutely crazy. Definitely, definitely crazy. And we have now heart, Persians, facing the Mayans, which is better than in the previous one. Because now we have switch spots. You know, the cavalry civilizations are against the Mayans and the other against the Turks. Fantastic. Miguel, oh, but Miguel with the hands, if he's still playing like he's playing. Oh my god. Well, Miguel is playing in a very, very good level. I'm happy and glad for, for Miguel because I think he's a player that a lot of people have underestimated him big time. Because he was. It's true that he needs to be constant. Constant. Play like this. This is the most important. I mean, most of the players in in, each, uh, in this community, in my opinion, they have a huge level. Everyone, most of them, right? The problem is that they don't show this level probably all the time or in tournaments. But if they were at their top level in the tournaments, then we will see crazy competition. And absolutely, you will, you maybe will see the Piper winning a lot or the most, but not like he's winning. And what we want is challenge. Good and strong competition. So hopefully, hopefully, yeah. The player is going to play like they are doing lately more and more and more and better. That's the way to go, in my opinion. And everyone won't. And they the first. Yes. Well, let's see now. Going to lure the board. And now we can go for the resources placement. A stone close to... To the walls, relic inside, berries on the left, gold at the back, another stone at the back, another gold to outside, okay, four villages on, on, on wood, look at that gold on uh, inside, but at the back, pretty safe map from heart, a stone close to the walls, another stone really really exposed, not the best, those relics they have to fight, don't belong to anyone, to be honest, they have to fight, a bit closer maybe to green, here, but this one also a bit closer to red, but similar distance. Then resources for Eddie, pretty super good, right? Stone, gold at the back, everything all right. Berries forward, but doesn't matter. The deers, so far, that's not good, so far. And the deers for green, oh, but look also his, his, uh, his arena, he can get uh, ready at the back, okay. Well, I don't see his deers. Maybe he, he took already, or, or I'm blind, but I don't see green deers. Ay, ay, ay. Ah, it's here, okay, outside. Then yellow, we saw the resources, and now only purple, Miguel. Gold exposed, that stone is fine. And something else? No, this is not the best map, because he doesn't have safe resources. Still, on a side, and he is facing Leary with Mayans that is pretty close to him. Pretty close, so well, let's see, man. Well, let's see. Okay. Well, now he's pushing the deers, Leary. But guys, this is too zero already. Anyway, the cities are pretty long. Best of nine. Remember, best of nine. Okay. Let's see if they are going to do... I'm really curious if they will pick the same strategy than the previous. Oh, what are... What is he flaring? The gold? I don't know who flared there. This is her point of view. Let's go to Leary. I think it might be hard. I don't know. Okay. Uh, we'll, we'll see. Two farmers. Uh, four ships Still four ships left Three farmers already no farmers three farmers already from heart you can see Just little difference two lumber camps already hard. Okay One two lumber camp at in different spot now. He's going to to mine gold. No, he's not going Hello, I'm really curious to see what Eddie is going to do with the Turks. And heart eats on the way to feudal age with 25 population. Yes! Who is getting five games? It's winning the tournament. Definitely.
Yeah, I want to really see. Well, he's buying a stone. And uh, the good thing, well, good thing from Hart is that he's not really, really close to him. It's a bit far. It will be more scary even here, right? In this position, Turks, super close. Exposed goal. It's true, man. His goal. But I'm okay because I'm doing a stable. Okay. Everyone going to Fiddle Edge. We see now Eddie and Miguel going slower with 28 population because he's gonna go stone and gold. And because Eddie, because Miguel, sorry, he's gonna go barrack and stable. That reason, he's not going that fast. He will need to mine coal, he will need a bit more resources, and that's it. Yes, they did. And Hart and Leary won in the winner brackets. Hello everyone joining the channel. Oh, so many lover boys, man. Thank you for following. Barack already. Thank you for the follow. Welcome to the channel. Well, this is one of the tournaments that is about to finish. This is the grand final, but don't forget that the nation's cap is going to be there, man. Really soon, in about two weeks or less than two weeks, ten days, it will start. Will start to to happen. First, with the first round, usually the more unbalanced, but then, later, top 16, top 8, oh man, gonna be strong, gonna be really strong. Let's see, Tugul is on goal, and his resources, you can see his resources, about to go castle, it's right away when, when he's in, in feudal. Heart, it's already up, with 27 villages, he's almost the same time that Miguel did before, so it's super, super strong. Sending the deers, getting inside. There you go. Okay. Thank you for following. Really appreciate it, guys. We are going to enjoy together with the following. You will see. Well, Leary, 15 minutes, 29 seconds. He's mining a stone. So he's gonna drop a castle. Oh, well, again without goal. So he's gonna go Thank you for, for the same strategy that in the first game, but it didn't work out. It's gonna work out now? Well, Eddie and Miguel, 30 population, 15 minutes, 46, 48 seconds. It's, I, I wouldn't say standard, but yeah, but uh, it's the way to go, right? 30 is good population to be in 15 minutes in Castellis. That means the Dark Age Feudal Age is pretty good As you can see one two three four five six seven farmers with five villages on stone three villages on gold one lumberjack with four villages and another one with another four villages pretty nice build order here so let's see what he's going to be able to do eddie he's gonna make the castle right away i i imagine or he will make first dc like for example Liri. i think he's gonna do it well let's see man let's see Six villages on stone. Oh, he's gonna go siege. Sending the scouts. Yeah, they were they would try to play aggressive. That's nice. To go for relics. Yeah, like I told you, he's not gonna make the castle. He's doing tone centers. For now, they are playing a bit standard, not doing anything special. Look at that TC on stone, another TC on gold and wood. Two extra tone centers, while Eddie, <laughs> I love how Eddie, no matter if he's a tournament or not, he's just playing his place, his style. Five villages forward, doing a castle on his face, really on his face. I will go to hard point of view to see if he can spot it. No! He cannot see it. So I'm telling you that Eddie, when he's going to get inside, and he will, fast and unpredictable, he will put in big troubles to Hart. Really? Because with some Peters and Janissars, what is he going to, to do, man? Whoa. Whoa. Well, the castle is going to be there. He probably will palisade a bit more. Now he's doing an outpost. Yes, but that outpost is going to be late because he's going to see the castle on his face or he's going to be in time. Yes, he can see now the castle. Let's see if they are going to flare. Well, I don't think they will because they are on team speak. Now he's starting to make more houses and 
Starting to make some walls. Forward castle. And the push is gonna happen. Genisars and imagine if purple is also sending exactly knights. So the double is gonna be real. With this caster, he's also taking the control of the relics. Except this one, of course, and this one that are inside. Castle, also for Leary. We have two marches. One, two, tone centers. Genisars, gonna be almost inside. The houses. Oh man. Yeah, he's gonna break the walls really fast. He did a mail. Taking the relics. He's only one TC, of course. And Miguel, three tone centers. The hands are just great. And Miguel managed those civilizations like we have seen already. Pretty, pretty good. Yeah. Well, I'm surprised too the VUC 009. But it's nice for the viewers. It's nice for us. He did a stone wall, he's going aggressive with the rams, he's gonna make a siege war up. Oh man, but let's see what is he going to be able to do. He need to wall more. He can see hard that he's coming with the scouts, yes, he know that this is a double. And the siege war up is not gonna be up, because if he's not doing up then... Oh man, this is absolutely a beautiful Titanic by heart. Yes, how he's gonna stop now? Rams, Genisars and everything. Whoa, man, he's sending blue marchers. This is a grand final. And Miguel and Eddie, for now, they are on domination mode. Well, Hart is gonna make a castle. There you go. He's gonna drop, chop that tree. Oh, well, he did the castle. He's doing the castle there. He's gonna be in time. Probably he's gonna make it the castle. Oh, 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 he's not gonna make it in time. Ay, 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 ay. The rams are coming. The knights are coming as well. Look at those genesis. Oh my god. 30%. If he's getting those villages, he's gonna be 3 0. 3 0. Fast and unpredictable. I don't want this happen. Please. He's sending all the damn villages. This is absolutely disaster. And Titanic by heart and Leary. Definitely. Whoa! 48 population, Eddie the same population, but they are killing a lot, a lot of villages, he's gonna keep killing so many, he's migrating now with the plume arches, moving all those, 45 population, the thing is, that he's full push, that's truth, so maybe they are going to be able to still doing something in this game, but gonna be really complicated, look at that, man gonna be coming, let's see if he's gonna kill those genisar, he need to put the village on the TC, and now, with the Plume Arches, Botkin is gonna be able to do something. He's gonna make the castle, I think. He's gonna make the castle. He's coming now with the Mangonel. He's gonna send the villages. Ay, 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 ay. Go back. The Mangonel is gonna be bye-bye. You need to make the, the damn castle. Make the castle or it's gonna be game over. The castle is up. And now he need to go back. Definitely. Yes. There you go. Well, the castle is just protecting that path. But still... Still, uh, well, he's gathering gold. Well, 45 population, 45 police, and Eddie 41. Is Eddie preparing his... No, he doesn't have the resources yet. Okie dokie. And it's a pause. Wow, I need this kind of pauses because this is too much for me. The problem is yeah, that Miguel, again, with few knights, two, three knights, it's already with 61 villagers. So they just kill kill the Persians boom. So how now Mayans is gonna stop the hands, sorry. Yeah, how he's gonna stop the hands. Well, we will find out very soon. Let's see what they are going to do. They keep going. It's not a big pause. Now he's trying to go. The Mangonel is there. He's gonna kill the siege war shot. He's gonna make something else with that village. I don't know what he's trying to do, to be honest. Now doing a monastery. Oh, let's see. 50%. The speed. Otherwise, he's gonna freeze the game. When they pause too much, that village in danger to be lost. Yes. Don't know what he's doing. He's there with one mangonel. Now he cannot attack too much anymore. But let's see if Eddie's gonna... Ooh. Yeah, he's wall himself. Two tone center, so he's not going for fast imperial. Well, they did some good damage. Population is still almost the same. Go for all. I'm pushing Leary now. Oh, he's gonna pu -pu 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 push Leary now. Whoa, he's playing so confident, man. One, two, three, four tone centers. Stable siege wars up, and he's gonna push Leary. Why? Because he can keep pushing here. Those TCs is the only way he's more or less 
alive, right? Or he will be alive. Those Persian TC are just sick. But now with the mangle, be careful. Those Yenis are extremely strong. He's doing some. So Monk, I think Eddie will make another castle on his face. This is what he's preparing with those villages. He might do a castle here. And that castle will kill both those centers. And then it's game over. But here now, two rams. Is Leary going to notice? Because if he do not notice, ay ay ay. Well, let's go to Leary point of view. He can make another castle. But right now, no reaction yet. He didn't notice yet. Oh, come on, if he's breaking in, he's gonna make a natural disaster. He's doing the ballistic, ballistic incoming. Let's see the mango. No, no, he didn't kill it. Now he's moving the, the mango at the back. He has another one. Repair the mango. It's not gonna work because those genies are, are extremely strong. And here he's doing the castle, expect it. Let's see if he's gonna be able to do it in time. I think he will be in time, but some problems, man. Some problems. Well, with two castles, he might be okay. Oh, oh, oh. Ay, 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 ay. But now Miguel is not going fast. No, that castle is gonna be up. But make some walls, man. Nah, he's doing he's doing the castle. It's good. It's good. The castle is up. Go the villages. Now the rams. But the rams and the knights. Oh, man. Oh, man. The castle exactly in that spot. The castle for... The castle for heart is not the best castle ever. It is not, man. It's not because he's far and without Botkin, not in the range. Now, trying with the village to kill those knights. This is absolutely over. This is for now in a total domination mode. Well, remember. Knight plus one plus two against those blue marches. It's good amount of blue marches. Let's see if with the blue marches from behind, he's gonna be able to kill those knights. He's doing a good job there. He need to... To save that castle, he will be in big trouble. Those blue matches are really, 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 really strong. Ballistic and plus two. And plus two armor as well. No, he's gonna steal alive. He's gonna steal alive. But here, both with the castle. No fletching. Well, fletching. And now those villains. Ay, 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 that castle. Let's see Leary. Hard is not going up to Imperial. And Eddie, he will go up to Imperial. Wow. Playing super, super strong. Miguel and Eddie. Total domination. Now we're gonna kill the Rams, yes, but the damage is also done. Why? Because they are on the way to Imperial, man. Miguel, it's on the way to Imperial. Eddie will go up to Imperial too, and Leary will go on the on the way to nothing. Yes, he will be late. And the uh, heart? Well, heart, nothing. When they reach Imperial, I mean, if the score is super close, they will call the GG. Nothing to do. He's got ooh, petard, man, petard rush. He's gonna go petards? Is the only way to go for him? Oh, probably. Well, he's repairing, but he's sending one petard one by one. Like this, you are not gonna kill, man. You need to surprise him now. He's repairing forever. All right. Oh, man. Oh, man. Well, a lot of blue marchers. Cartography. And, well, maybe Leary can go up? Yes, he will, because Mayans is extremely strong. So, let's see if Leary can do some magic. But he needs to really make magic. It's true that Eddie, 55 villages, 55 villages, but heart in big trouble. Big trouble. Well, knights, castle, we're gonna have trebuchet faster than Leary. 31 minutes, 57 seconds, 120 population, 111 villagers, and doing army during all the game. Not a lot, but doing an oath to make the damage, to make the damage on heart. And to also push Leary and be faster in period than Leary. Strong man, really strong play, definitely. Well, the knights are going, but the castle is there. Siege Warsop, he full ca he full castle, yeah. Let's go to hard. Is is going up? Imp? No, it is seven. Still far from Imperial. I have the feeling that when they reach Imp. Miguel in Imperial. Well, they are not. But when Eddie is Imp, hopefully they gonna put some fight because it's a final, but it's so complicated. Let's see. I am on hard point of view. He's with a lot of petardos. So with the petards, he might kill one castle. It's possible, but he will never go up to Imperial. Well, we have Eddie in Imperial. 
Nice, they keep trying, they keep trying. This is a lot of Plume Archers, but now he's doing a castle on his face, not letting him take that goal. And Lear, almost Imperial. How he's gonna deal with Cavaliers? He needs more and more army, more and more Plume Archers. Look at the Petters, man. <laughs> Please, kill the castle with the Petters, can be beautiful. Let's see this Petard attack. Come on, man, you need to kill the damn castle, but he has... Four mangonels, lot of genisers, the bomber cannon already, and now siege workshop. More petters, a lot of rams, yes, a lot of rams, but how to kill the damn genisers? The castle is gonna be bye bye, you need to repair that castle, he has better population than Eddie. Here he's losing the castle and how, how he's gonna stop now those cavaliers. The impressor, chemistry, everything, castle at the back, they are playing so standard, not like arena. And Miguel? Paladin upgrade on the way. Paladin upgrade on the way, which is absolutely crazy. Well, I think he's gonna kill the castle, probably. Probably gonna kill the castle. Ay, ay, ay. He's killing the castle. Petars. Go, go, go. He's killing the castle. Yes! No! He didn't kill the castle, and that's the game over, man. He didn't kill the castle. He needs one petar more. I want to cry when I see things like this. He didn't kill the castle, and absolutely, that was instantly game over. And he was Paladin Abred already. Extremely... Thank you for following. Total domination for now. 3-0, Eddie and Miguel. 3-0. Still a lot of games to maybe go, hopefully. Because right now, wow. Army. Eddie killed the most. 53 largest army. Miguel... 125 villains, 863, and no for him. He's boom Miguel, out boom everyone. And you can see, guys, the score, and you have seen the game. Total domination. 3 0, guys. 3 0.